My name's Anna Jones and I'm a cook and food writer. I love doing what I do because everyone is interested in food, everyone wants to talk about food, everyone has to eat. So I'm going to make my roast beetroots with sweet garlic yoghurt and ducca spice. So I'm going to start off by just chopping the greens off the beetroots. You just want to leave like about an inch on the top of each one. So we're just going to give these a quick wash. So I love this dish because it's a flavour contrast and also it's a temperature contrast. So you have the hot, earthy, sweet beetroots and then you have the kind of fresh yoghurt with the sweetness of the garlic and a bit of orange in there. Um, and then the crunch of the spices and the duck. So every mouthful is slightly different and it's a really, really great start to a meal. This is going to go in the oven for about 30 minutes because they're quite small beetroots. If you have bigger beetroots, 40 or 50 minutes. So we've got the creamy Liberté Greek yogurt here. This is going to add a real kind of depth to the dish. So it's going to be a lovely foil against the kind of earthy sweetness of the beetroots and the crunch and butteriness of the spices and nuts. Cooking for me is something that everyone has in common and I love that. It's something that I can always start a conversation about and there's something quite sort of democratic about cooking and about food that I really love. So next is my South Indian Spice cauliflower steaks. They come with some lemony potatoes, greens and an amazing green chutney. Yogurt I think is one of the most versatile ingredients in my kitchen. I use it in sweet recipes, I use it in savoury recipes, I use it to cook with, I use it, you know, just plain as it is to spoon on top of stuff. And you can see that the yoghurt has kind of just formed this really, really delicious golden topping on top. All done. So next I'm going to make my caramel and citrus pavlova. I'm going to start off with meringues. It's best to make meringues in a stand-up mixer like this or with an electric hand whisk. We've got the four egg whites and a pinch of salt in there and then we're going to turn the mixer on and mix until we've got kind of soft peaks. The creamy taste of the Liberté Greek yogurt works really well in all the recipes today. This is going to be a real centrepiece at the end of the meal. The only really difficult part is making the pavlova. The yogurt is just literally stirred together and then you've just cut up the citrus. I'm just going to drizzle over the caramel and sprinkle over some of these amazing edible flowers just before we sit down. So I've had a quick change and I'm going to freshen up and then it's down for dinner. I love having a house full of people. I love that chatter. I love hearing knives and forks and plates. Um, I love having music on. I just love, I love the offering of making food and putting it on a table for people. No one is ever happier than when you give them a plate of delicious food.